everyone welcome to this new tutorial in this tutorial we are going to see how we can detect uh, uh, different lines in the image with the help of half transform so this is our input image as you can see here and this is our result we are successfully able to detect all the possible lines that are present in the uh, in input, input image so this is basic uh, implementation from the input to the output and let's see how we are going to implement this in MATLAB so getting started with the input image we don't have any input image from the internet or other sources but we are creating the lines by ourselves with the help of these dimensions so these are the dimensions uh, points that we are going to use and make every possible line from one point to uh, all, uh, all any other alternative point and uh, this is a uh, this is a command that it, that is uh, drawing the line this is insert shape and it will be specified as a line and you have to provide the starting point and the ending point then we specify the color and other uh, parameters so upon execution uh, we will get this image so this is our and here you can see 00, zero. so this is our uh, zero, 00 location and this is our 200 by 200 this is uh, uh, 200 by 0 and so on so all these lines are drawn from this code in the next stage we are converting our image into uh, black and white image so we can apply half transform so we are first we are converting it to RGB into gray then we are binarizing it because the half transform will take the images which have only uh, black and white pixels so uh, this is uh, conversion of the input image and the next stage here this is the main function where we compute half transform on the black and white image and what we are getting from here is theta and rho theta and rho are the values which are written by this function and h is the half transform so let's see and uh, we just compute this half transform on the input image this is the result of half, half transform and uh, in this image these uh, regions where you can see the highest values these locations these locations are the points where we can assume that uh, these points are the locations where we will find our lines so and these regions they have lesser possibility of uh, detecting lines so we are going to use these peaks as our detection of lines in the next stage here we have to apply some threshold to find the peaks so we uh, apply a threshold and uh, we specify maximum possible number of lines that is 15 you can adjust it according to your uh, need and then we uh, use this uh, thresholded uh, half transform to detect the uh, theta and rho and the in the next line we will detect the line and what is this line this line uh, gives us information when we explore this line function uh, output we will see it will provide us different points just, li just like point 1 and point 2 this is x1 x y1 this is x2 y2 this is the angle of that line and this is the row and so on so you uh, you can see here these are the possible lines that are detected by our algorithm and when we draw uh, all these lines with the help of for loop so we draw all these lines in a loop and draw on the 
resultant image so this is our result at the end what we are going to do we are uh, just printing out vertical lines and the horizontal lines that are available uh, in this image so run this section and uh, as we see here these there are three vertical lines and two horizontal line and uh, it is obvious from this our graph we can see here these two are the vertical lines these three and one this one and these two are horizontal lines so our result is quite similar to the output so this was the implementation of a uh, half transform if you are interested in getting this code subscribe to this channel and uh, drop an email given in the comment section and if you are interested in uh, getting your uh, project so you can contact in the description below thank you very much